reach over and cut my motherfucking lights off. <laughs> I need you to cut your cell phone off because if it was that important, they would just leave a voicemail. I need you to close your laptop because Facebook and Twitter can wait. Cut off the TV because none of those basketball bitches are in this relationship. <laughs> I need you to blow out the candles and close the blinds tonight. You're mine. Okay. You see, all I want to hear is... your silhouette. Tonight we're going to dance a sort of sexual pirouette. So I'll start with a kiss on your neck, a smooth caress of your breasts, and slide my hand into them panties. No surprise, you're soaking wet. So now we shed the articles of clothing to be sure we don't lose my leave a path of clues with my tongue from your head to where your toes is. Let's role play. The doctor feels your pulse as I kiss your chest, your heart is racing, so lie down in my bed, take your time, girl, be. Be patient. Patient because, because I want to eat it so long, you get full. And as a child, swimming lessons were a blessing, but I definitely intend on drowning in this pool. I'm going to pretend that they stopped making them. And I got the last one. So when I eat, it'll be slow, sensual. I want to enjoy this. And tonight, I am the unselfish bearer of excess orgasm, so I'm going to be throwing these motherfuckers at you like, here, baby, have some. <laughs> you see, I need you to feel every one of my taste buds. That way when I give you hair from behind, it'll be at the very forefront of your mind tomorrow afternoon when you wake up. But it's time for business. You say, before I slide in, you said trip, go slow. It's been a while since we did this stuff. I slid up in and felt the tension, shocked, and just a bit embarrassed about how true that statement was. So for your sake, I'ma go slow. But for mine, I'ma go deeper and run. And deeper, and deeper with every other stroke, I feel you jerk, you trying to scream, but you can't seem to find your notes. Switch! But right before it's your turn to get on top and fuck me in order to further aid me in my orgasmic experiences, you form a 90 degree angle at your knees and you show me your thought process. <laughs> and what a beautiful mind it is. Because I'll be damned if you don't always succeed. <laughs> now I got you on top of me, rocking me back, back. <laughs> Aaliyah couldn't have sung my shit better. I feel my stomach getting wetter. And you, your cowgirl is reversed. You practicing perfect posture on this pipe as if the position was rehearsed. We fucking it like it's our jobs. And we both make minimum wage, so we overtime and make it work. We both make it work. We both in sexual submission. I wonder who'll tap first. But premature is the worst, so I pull out. And I reintroduce my lips to your lips and let the four of them converse. I want you to put the whole, like the whole thing, right here. I'm talking about unlimited minutes. You deserve to spend more than just weekends and nights here. Carmex ain't never had a nigga mouth this moist. <laughs> I'ma talk to it for so long that from now on, when it fart, it'll be in this voice. I'm a grown ass man. And I feel like every man should look a little. And I figure if it was nutritious enough to bear life, I might as well live a little. No doubt. But now I got five fingers worth of your natural hair and a palm full of that ass, and I'm hitting from behind that. 
I got you running from me, you scratching, you reaching for the non-existent. Don't be foolish, baby, you'll never find that. <laughs> I'm not usually one to brag, but this type of dick and to have you up late in the afternoon thinking it's early, reminiscing of positions of submission I had you in last night while you seasoning them eggs you fixed. And I prefer cheese on my shit. <laughs> I know right about now you can feel me swimming around in your tummy, that pain in your upper thighs, but don't give up. I need you to be a trooper. When I throw the dick, I need you to catch it, rotate, wiggle it around, and throw that thing right back to me. Some of y'all ain't gonna throw it back in. <laughs> and you got a mouth on you. So you always got that one friend that you be telling about the way we do our shit, but check. Next time we around each other, don't be surprised when she mugging you and mugging me and he looking dumb and she look at him like, nigga, why we can't have this? But there's a difference between them and us. They lust. This is love. But that's just the way I like to start my nights off. But before you get this work, I need you to reach over and cut my motherfucking lights off. <laughs>